to a, another video from Agne. Um, this one is going to be covering how to fight properly on the island. Um, now, there's a lot of different things to go with that. Um, mm -hmm. So this is going to be a kind of a long video and you're going to be seeing some gameplay in the background while we're doing it. And I'm going to explain what to do and what not to do while we're going. Um, so buckle in and let's get on with it. So first off, um, we're going to get into our usual disclosures and I actually have one to add. Um, I recently possibly have a sponsor that I will be um, introducing very soon. So keep tuned to that. It will save you money in the game while you are playing and also help me out and also be um, first on the road to what we're trying to achieve as far as being able to also pay you guys for simply being subscribers and helpers. Um, and going into that, uh, first off, uh, there will be a Discord link in the description below. This Discord is my YouTube channel Discord. This is only for, um, this is a community tool, so it's, it's there to be able to be helping people and um, assisting people. So there's absolutely no bashing, no bullying, anything like that. So if you do, you're gonna be kicked and banned immediately. Now, okay, um, on top of that, like I had said in previous videos, um, when I start getting any monetary advantage to the content that I put out, like I might very well from the sponsor, um, the first three months, 100% of anything that I get will be given away in a bi-weekly um, draw or for this sponsor it might be uh, monthly, but um, it will be given away to the people for simply being subscribers and, and being there. After that, hold on, let me do that. After the first three months, it will be given away in a monthly draw to whoever is subscribed and in the Discord channel. I will require proof to of both things. Anyway, um, so let, let's get into it. So first off, the worst thing you can do is solos. As you can see, they are soloing a lot. Um, you never solo anything. If you lose on a hit, you never solo. That's one of the biggest things that you can really mess up on is soloing anything. Because at the end of the day, this is a stamina game. So if you are not playing it like it is a stamina game and trying to primarily waste their stamina, then you're doing it wrong. So everything should be a rally. You should never, ever hit a hill. There is zero point on island. You're not going to get any resources because nobody has resources during island, especially open. So trying to hit a hill solo or anything like that is absolutely useless now in the case of like if you need somebody to be moved um the best thing to do like if, if they're in a spot that you really could use the best thing to do is to do a dual rally on them and then directly after have like three or four people send solos so that way you can port them out of their spot sorry i'm fighting and telling this at the same time the other thing is that towers are the main game to things. So you need to make sure at all times that you, you are destroying the towers. Um, you're saving clay. Uh, the, the mistake that the alliance that we're currently facing for the win made is they did not save clay for two days prior to our uh, agreed tree battle. So they made a really huge mistake to be honest um that will end up costing them probably the win because 
they they should have saved clay because the way i'm looking at it right now is they didn't save clay so they're gonna have seven towers max so if i push them back nine towers my knight shit doesn't have to do anything so that is something that you always have to keep a lookout for uh but like i said it, it's all about stamina and fungi so if they're hill hitting have your uh, on garrison have your leads maybe have one march garrison um just so that you can make sure that you know they don't get poured out while they're doing a rally or anything like that but you need to focus on the fact of getting down those towers so what we usually do is we set dual rallies on or we set rallies anytime the, the tower is taken the all the rally leads do everybody fills them after it's taken everybody immediately starts spamming to fill but the rally leads do not because the rally leads need to keep their stamina for taking it back over after that like i said everybody starts trying to fill and that's how you wear down the timer like you can see on these they're at 44 percent and that one's at an hour but it's about to be filled um actually no well no but it is at 45 percent so we're doing two towers at once when they can't even begin to try to touch anything of ours because they're too busy defending because we have the system down packed so what they're trying to do right now is I'm surprised they're not hill hitting because they've been doing it the entire island. But um, they're, they're still solo attacking the Alliance Towers. There's very few rallies actually going on. Um, a lot of them are just trying to solo. There's a few smaller people. Yeah, see, there's a solo right there. Um, there's a few smaller people trying to rally. But the majority of them are trying to... Um, rally, which is surprising because that, that's something that they have not been doing. And I'm actually really, like I said, I'm really surprised that they are not solo hitting because, or solo hitting hills because they've been doing that quite a bit throughout the island. Um, but I mean, it, it is what it is and, you know, we'll keep on going and doing what we're doing. But those are the main points as far as as when you go to fight is you, you need to manage your um, fungi as well as your stamina. Stamina is honestly the biggest key and making sure that you know you have enough stamina to keep on going. And that's why we suggest doing rallies only. And like when you're filling the tower, even if it's going to fill up with who's marching to it, it doesn't matter, march to it anyway. Keep that, keep it filled because if they can't knock you out in a rally, then all you all you're doing is making sure that you can keep on keeping on so it's just a rotating rally all the time you know, if there's only one tower that we're focused on then what we'll do is our rally leads will set one rally and then once it's filled and starts marching we'll set another so that way if somebody is smart and knows what they're doing and is trying to do the same thing we have another rally from our rally leads that's going in exactly the same time well it's being filled while one is marching so even if they rally and take it over we're going to have another march that is marching towards it to be able to take it back and that's what you really need to do is to make sure you keep doing that so that you always have a rotating door of rallies going so that you can win the building some of these fights take hours, so you need to plan for it because stamina goes quick. We've been fighting for a little bit, and I mean, you can see what my stamina is. Granted, we took the tree first, but even still, it shows you how quick stamina actually can go. But anyway, I hope this video was informative, and Egna out. We will see you in the next one. Peace.